Hey everybody, this is PJ Riley from Lancaster Archery outside for a product video for you today. And this is one that I'm especially excited about as a long time climbing tree stand bow hunter. I am here with the new for 2022 Summit Viper Level Pro. So one of the biggest issues with climbing tree stands since the beginning of time have been how do you get these things level when you're up in the air? You know, with these climbing tree stands, you have to basically guess the angle, how to set it up at the base of the tree, because the tree's gonna get skinnier. You want everything to be level when you're up in the air. Over time, you can get good at that, but there are many times when you'll get up to your hunting height and the platform and your seat are either pitched a little bit up or a little bit down. And believe me, I have tried all the sketchy ways that there are out there to level these things. None of them have ever been approved by the tree stand companies. And we'll tell you about that system here in a minute, but let's go over the tree stand first. This is your basic Summit Viper. They've had this um, stand for a, a long time. Again, it is a climbing tree stand. You're going to sit down and stand up to get this uh, stand to go up the tree. It comes in two pieces. I've got them set up here. And what you're looking at here, it's all aluminum. So this tree stand with everything connected weighs 26 pounds. It's got a 300 pound max rating and you're gonna be able to use it on trees from eight inches in diameter to 20 inches. That's a pretty big tree. Um, so the, the platform here, that's where your dimensions are most critical. We've got 25 inches wide by 36 long. So that's a pretty generous size tree stand. And of course, with all the summit climbing tree stands, you've got your stirrups here that you hook your feet into. You're gonna hook your feet in to the stirrups behind this stretch band here that's gonna force your feet in. And again, it's a sit down stand up to go up the tree. Now, some of the um, features that Summit has added to these stands in recent years is the, the way the stand works is you got a cable that goes around both pieces here. And they have these barrels into them. And those barrels are what allow you to adjust for the diameter of the tree. Well, now Summit added their quick draw system. So you've got a safety lock right here. It's a pin. If you want to change, you would just pull that pin out. Now I've got a trigger under here. You can see the, the trigger holds this cable in place. But if I hit the trigger there, now I can slide in. I can go to the next barrel if I want to. Of course, I want it on this one. Put it in, release the trigger. Now this can't move. I put my pin in for safety. Got that in place. Uh, so that's, they've got that on the platform as well as the seat. Uh, and it works the same way for both of them. Now, uh, coming with in the pack, you are going to get the tether. So this is an important device here. You see, I've got it connecting the a seat portion to the platform. You always wanna have that connected and it is stretchable so that as you're climbing, you don't have to worry about it, you know, hitting, you know, not being able to pull it up high enough. But this is what's gonna be in the event something were to happen, your bottom will never fall out of your reach as long as you've got that tether there. It keeps the two pieces together. Uh, coming up to the top here, we've got, we've already installed our padded rest here. This is a nice pad that goes up the arms. You're going to be sitting in here resting your arms on there. This of course is where you're going to sit when you do the, the climbing portion of the climbing tree stand. And one of my favorite things about Summit tree stands are these hanging seats right here. These are in my opinion the most comfortable seats on the market. These seats are just so comfortable. The padding is nice and thick. You know, when you sit in there, it folds around you, but it doesn't, it's not like there's nothing there. There is some firmness to that, uh, which makes them comfortable. And of course they hang by these straps right here. So your weight is suspended. You can shift the seat forward or back, you know, through the day you're, you know, you want to uh, relieve some pressure on your back. You just slide forward or back with this. Got the back connected up here around the top. 
nice padded backrest. I love those Summit seats. Um, but now let's get to the main feature of this stand. So both sections, the seat and the platform, have this device right here that you can see. And you can, I've got it about halfway out. This is a, a screw device here. Basically, you're gonna turn this barrel. And as I'm turning the barrel counterclockwise, the, um, the cable is stretching out. So essentially, you can see the nose of this stand is pitched up just a little bit. So I'm turning it counterclockwise and that platform is lowering down. So that's what you're gonna do up in the air to level this stand. You know, if you need it, if you need to get that nose down, you're gonna turn it counterclockwise. If I need to go nose up, I'm gonna turn it clockwise. Just to bring that nose back up. Same thing up here, functions exactly the same way. This screw device here, you know, when you're up in the stand, you don't necessarily want to make huge adjustments. You've got your barrels uh, to make the big adjustments. This is going to be just to take that little bit of lean one way or the other out of it. That's what I would recommend using this for. You don't want to, you know, if your stand is sitting like that, you don't want to use this to get it level. I'd come down and redo it in that case. But so many times when you're up in a tree stand, the stand is always just off by a little bit, just a little bit, um, one way or the other. That's where this is going to come in. So you can see I've left it extended. Uh, this screw is probably about double this length. So I took it out about halfway to give me good movement one way or the other, whether I have to go up with it or I have to go down with it. All right, so up in the tree, of course, I have my safety harness attached here. As soon as you step off the ground, connect that to the tree all times. Um, but to get this leveling system to work, obviously on the seat portion, it's as simple as just standing here and then you turn the dial to get it to wherever you want it. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring the nose of the seat and the platform down because I'm just pitched up just a little bit just for demonstration purposes. So remember that is counterclockwise spinning on my handle here. Um, and again, the, the seat portion of it is simple. Where there's a little bit of logistics involved is if you have to adjust the foot portion. So you can't really have a ton of weight on the platform while you're working the handle screw over here. Um, so what I've found works is, uh, you know, I'm sitting on the back just like if I'm climbing up the tree pull this up as high as I can get it and then I just reach over the side and again turn counterclockwise. I'm kind of pulling up with my feet so that there's really not much weight on the platform. You can see I've got it up off the tree and then by that just lean over, undo that screw now I've got my, my platform leveled out. Uh, but again, in the past, you know, I mentioned there are all kinds of sketchy ways out there that people used to adjust tree stands in the air. Me among, I'm guilty as well. None of them were ever approved. Um, and it usually involved disconnecting this band in some fashion. You don't do that here, no matter what happens with this handle over here, I'm never disconnecting any piece of this tree stand from the tree. That's what makes it safe. No matter what, um, the, my stand is always connected, always safe. Okay, so your Summit Viper does pack together for backpacking and it comes with the backpack straps. I've just put them on already, but I just wanted to show you how this nests together to carry it out. So whenever I climb, I always connect these two sections, but to put it together after a hunt, you're gonna to wanna to disconnect these. And then you're just gonna take your stand platform, slide it inside the seat portion, just like that. You've got your actual seat you can see this gap right here. 
I'm going to take the top of my seat and stuff it through that gap. And what that's going to do is basically give me this seat pad against my back as I'm walking in. So I'm going to take this, tuck it under, take it over the top, and then I'm going to hook it to my seat to hold the pad upright. Got my tether connection. Just going to run that up. Now, to keep these things from rattling, you know, because these two sections will rattle, uh, you have your strap that goes around the seat portion and wraps around the tree. Just take this and feed it through. Now, once I pull this tight, Now those two sections aren't going to rub together. And now I just go around front, got my backpack strapped. And now I'm ready to go out of the woods again. All right, that is the Summit Viper Level Pro. Great new tree stand from the folks at Summit. I've been waiting for something like this my whole bow hunting life to have a climbing tree stand that you can safely adjust to level when you're up in the air. Can't wait to get out in the woods with it this fall. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like it, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Don't forget to click that bell to get notifications whenever we put out new videos. And as always, if you have any questions, you can visit us at LancasterArchery.com.